Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common challenge that many c -sharp developers encounter when working with JSON data. Our viewer is trying to deserialize a JSON array using Newtonsoft, but they're running into a frustrating error. Let's dive into the details of their question. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's get on to the video. To address the deserialization issue you're facing with Newtonsoft, let's first examine the JSON structure you're working with. The error message indicates that there's an unexpected character in your JSON. This often happens due to trailing commas. Let's fix that in your JSON example. Next, we need to ensure that our c -sharp classes match the JSON structure. Notice that you have duplicate class definitions. Let's correct that. Finally, let's deserialize the JSON correctly using the updated class. Make sure to use the correct type in the deserialize object method. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To deserialize a JSON array in c -sharp using Newtonsoft, ensure you have a proper list type. The current setup has a single instance called priv, but it needs to be a list-like type, such as list File thing is the type you're working with, make sure to define priv as list file thing to correctly deserialize the JSON array. And that's it. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. And until next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.